Hey, good, mo good morning, Menorca Navy here. It is Sunday morning. Uh, local time here is 8 a.m. in coastal Georgia, and we are still watching Debbie. Uh, we're waiting for our 8 o'clock advisory to come out, but what we're working off right now is our 5 o'clock advisory and the 5 o'clock advisory this morning showing that the storm is going to uh, become a hurricane earlier than what was originally anticipated. It's going to get still be a category one, probably be um, a, a higher category one when it makes landfall down around Perry, Florida, uh, in that area of um, the Big Bend, Florida, and uh, come across. Now, the, the thing that is really going to be crazy with this thing is the amount of rain. This is going to be a slow moving storm. Uh, most of the rain is going to be over on that right-hand side uh, and, and constantly feeding up. We're already seeing parts of Florida right now that are uh, being impacted by some of the outer bands of Debbie. Uh, still a tropical storm, and we say hurricane on our banner because the National Hurricane Center is saying this thing is going to intensify into a hurricane a little bit later on. Uh, and actually now, uh, quicker. Uh, they're saying by the by, at five o'clock this morning, the storm was going to intensify earlier. Here in coastal Georgia, we're still waiting and we are expecting a lot of rain. Um, it's not only going to be us that's going to get the rain, but uh, uh, probably into South Carolina, um, those folks are going to get a tremendous amount of rain too. Keep in mind, once that's once the storm makes landfall, it's still going to be pulling energy out of that warm Atlantic and it's going to be pushing that that moisture right up on the folks up in Carolina and it's going to, this thing's going to slow down and it's going to be a mess for us. Um, predictions right now, looking at national hurricane center or anywhere from like a, a, a foot of rain up to maybe 20 inches. So if that's not a, a lot of rain, um, you know, I don't, I don't know what is, it's going to be a humdinger for sure. Uh, that said, if you're in the area, in those areas, uh, start making preparations. Get up this morning, and if you have to sandbag things uh, to keep flood waters out, uh, do what you need to do to protect yourself from rising water or your property, because that is going to happen. We'll also tell you, keep an, keep an eye on um, the National Hurricane Center for the latest advisories on the storm. Uh, you know, we, we're not an official, certainly not speaking an official, just uh, some guys that have kind of kind of been through it and and understand a little bit of weather maps and what's going to happen here. We're going to see. It's not going to be a significant wind event. I mean, we're not going to see crazy winds out of this thing. We are going to get the rain. There's no doubt about it. Um, storm is still. Well, now we're looking at our eight o'clock advisories this morning, and it is. Not a lot of change from what we're seeing here with uh, with the storm uh, from five o'clock this morning. The the path still looks like it's going to be pretty close. They're saying, um, you know, it's going to be Tuesday. Our, our worst part of it here for us locally, as far as wind is concerned, is probably going to be uh, Tuesday through uh, the very early morning hours of Wednesday. And still hurricane warnings now are being posted for uh, that Big Bend area of Florida as they're expecting now hurricane conditions there within the next 24 hours. Um, guys, if you're there, good morning. Um, uh, Catherine, yeah, if you're in North Florida, pay attention to this thing, especially if you are prone to, to flooding. Uh, and keep in mind, it might not be your immediate area, but uh, uh, any type of traveling or anything that, that you do, don't drive into standing water, guys. This this thing is going to dump an incredible, incredible amount of rain for 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 South Georgia and North Florida. We're going to get a lot of rain, uh, and it's going to be a slow moving event. That is for sure. Um, it's coming. Like I said, today is the day to make preparations. And um, 
Florida is already being impacted down around Naples, uh, Sarasota, uh, Tampa. Uh, those folks are, are in the line now to start feeling some of the some of the outer bands of the of tropical storm Debbie, and they are expecting expecting the storm according to the, to the report here about the time it gets uh but it's going to be north of north of tampa uh, probably cedar key lat long in that area right there where it strengthens into into an actual hurricane uh, but it's going to continue continue to get stronger and keep in mind that again the right hand that right hand side of the storm that side of the storm as it's coming up the west coast of florida is where the rain is and then all that's going to kind of kind of just wrap around and envelop uh, north florida and uh south georgia when it gets there so yeah it's coming yeah gainesville florida is going to be impacted with a with a probably significant amount of rain as well uh, Again, I don't think that the uh, the wind is gonna is gonna be as uh, crazy as maybe you guys have seen in the past, uh, but you're gonna get a lot of rain. And keep in mind, if you get a lot of rain, a lot of soil saturation, um, it doesn't take much wind for trees to come down, pull down power lines, uh, block intersections, uh, roadways, uh, come down on your home. Uh, keep keep all those things in mind as as the storm begins to kind of progress and move that way because guys it's coming it is it, it is it's it's going to be it's going to be a lot of flooding a lot of local localized flooding here uh when it comes again north florida uh, south georgia and into the carolinas it's coming make preparations if you need to all right we're going to continue to monitor it uh you guys uh, take care. Uh, remember, the National Hurricane Center has all this information on their website, and there's some other good good resources out there as well. Uh, but stay in tune with it, and this stuff is coming. Okay, you guys take care and, and be safe out there.